This episode is brought to you by Sneak Tech, the new silent technology. Scree, extreme mountain hunting. SRB Field Rests, the rests you can rely on. Sportsman's Warehouse, take it outside. Vortex Optics, the force of optics. Badlands, the original unconditional warranty. All right, everybody. We've uh, traveled nine and a half hours into New Mexico from Utah. We uh, just got to our motel room and we're getting situated for an early morning hunt tomorrow morning. We're here with Frank Parmio with Diamond A Outfitters. It's opening morning of the elk bull hunt in New Mexico. Um, we started about 5.30 this morning and we've done about a two mile hike. Coming in, we've seen tons and tons of fresh sign. Uh, we just haven't seen anything. Frank's been doing really good at showing us the area and doing calling for us. And uh, tell us a little bit about yourself, Frank. Well, we've been out here on this ranch now for about 15 years. Uh, family owned ranch, cattle ranch. And we've been hunting it for quite some time now. We've done really well here on the ranch. Uh, we've gotten some exceptional bulls. Um, I would say our average bull is probably around 300 or so. Uh, but we have gotten bulls up in the 370s and 380s. Uh, there's a lot of sign, like Jeremy was saying. Uh, you can kind of see here in the background, two weeks ago for the bow hunt, uh, we called in uh, multiple bulls in this area a couple of weeks ago on um, the walk-in and there's a lot of rubs everywhere. Uh, they're in here, we just got to be patient. But uh, yeah, we'll find this out. Right down below us, as you can see, is a pretty decent sized little pond. Um, this is what we're going to be watching. So we're going to talk about what happened this morning. We're here with Diamond A Outfitters down in New Mexico. We went out this morning and we hiked and we hunted and we just didn't get into them. Um, we did find some fresh, fresh sign. They are in there. Uh, we, will, we will locate some bulls. It'll probably be this afternoon, this evening, or probably tomorrow morning before we locate some bulls. Uh, 